Hello, you are watching Coin News. Here, Sada Giri TV2. Today, we will take you away from the ordinary reality and try to change it. We will talk about the augmented reality. The virtual reality, now confronted in every aspect of our lives and developing work regarding rising reality, is in progress. Augmented reality, or in short AR, is a live direct or indirect view of a physical, real-world environment whose elements are augmented by computer-generated or extracted real-world sensory input such as sound, video, graphics, haptics or GPS data. AR has potential to use in wide range of fields, from gaming industry to military technology, healthcare to education. Now there is a project which can take this technology into blockchain and make the development one step further. Today live with us, co-founder of the Arcona project, Daniel Girdea. Let us introduce him to you. Meet Daniel Girdea, entrepreneur and international relations specialist. Daniel has studied in the international relations field, holds bachelor's degree. He has started his career as sales manager at IT Ipan in Chisinau, Moldova. Also worked there as a top manager and corporate sales manager. Later, worked at Moldcell as sales executive. He founded, co-founded some startups, and as he describes, he failed. He did not focus on his mistakes, so founded My Way LLC in Moldova, an investment firm in real estate field and succeeded. Also, now he is successfully managing two of his projects, way to all and Arcona projects related blockchain-based augmented reality. He believes that the project he is currently managing is merging together real and virtual worlds, creating a digital earth. Nice to meet you in Colesco in new studio, Daniel. Hi. Tell us please a little bit about Arcona. Yeah, sure. So, First, my name is Daniel, as you mentioned, I'm the founder of Arcona project. And uh, in Arcona, we invented the digital land. And uh, Arcona is augmented reality ecosystem. Uh, it is uniting the physical world and the virtual one in uh, one information space, which we call the mixed reality or our digital land. And uh, in this ecosystem, uh, basically everyone can interact with augmented reality because it's a single information space for everyone, where everyone can interact with augmented reality in the real world, because the digital land is linked directly to the real world locations. So in two words, it sounds like this. Give us more details about the augmented reality and in which sphere do you plan to use it in future? First of all, I can say that augmented reality will be integrated in all the industries and all the business systems world. So I just can mention some cases that you can use in the augmented reality in Arcono ecosystem. As an example, can be the tourism market like we did. So we have already working cases in augmented reality in tourism market. So the people can come to the ruins. They see the mystic architectural masterpieces. They see just the ruins and nothing more. They are walking around the ruins. They're trying to imagine how these ruins were in the past. And uh, we provided the opportunity for them to travel in time and to see how those castles and churches looked like in the past. So using the application, using the augmented reality, the people can uh, see the real world. I mean, when they are looking around, they will see the real world, uh, the real buildings, but only when they are looking on the ruins, they will see those missing architectural masterpieces. And that is mixed reality. So, and today it's a working business because the people are still paying money. They're paying the fees for the this content to look this at uh, this closed content and the tourism in uh, tourism cards and uh, the next is uh, can be the advertising also because uh, the advertising channels are oversaturated in the real world and uh, they are on the top already but in augmented reality in Arcona you have plenty of places where you can use the digital advertising and all the traffic from the real world will be engaged into the Arcona and all the traffic will be the traffic well, from the real world, it will be the real traffic in the Arcona system. And construction. So the construction companies can show the, the buildings that uh, today do not exist. They are still starting the construction, but they can already attract the users, the customers to that place and to show them how the building will be in the future. And the people can look at it, the people can enter inside to see that building, how it is inside and outside also and game, gaming industry, industry, entertainment. So there are plenty of uh, the cases that can be used because I mentioned that 
all the industries will be engaged in augmented reality. <laughs> because the augmented reality will be the biggest community in the world in 2019. It will disrupt the television and the, all the rest. It will be the second internet, I think. Sounds good. How do you plan to integrate blockchain technology into the augmented reality and why precisely blockchain? Thanks to blockchain, we can provide the protection of the rights to our developers and our 3D artists. Because Arcona, it will be the open source ecosystem and all the developers from all around the world will be engaged in it. And uh, we are going to protect the rights by blockchain and the smart contract, all the, every line of the code and any con 3D content that will be provided by the, uh, our developers and the, all developers around the world, uh, they will get the royalty for this code. They will get the royalty for these 3D models that we will use in the ecosystem, you know. So this is one thing. Uh, the second one is that we can, uh, using our token, we are using it as an internal currency. So using the internal currency, the people can buy the land, they can buy the content, they can lease the land, then they can pay the fees for the content and so on. Let's talk a little bit about your token Arcona. Why do you need to issue a token? So token will be used as the internal currency of the ecosystem. Uh, using the token, uh, all the token holders will be able to buy the land, they will lease the land or rent the land from the ecosystem. Uh, using the marketplace, because and the, it will be launched the marketplace in the ecosystem, in Arcona. In, this, in the marketplace you can buy the content, you can uh, create the content and sell it. So if, for you to understand that we are bringing together the developers and the users and uh, the businessmen and their customers in the single space. We are bringing them in our marketplace. So from one part will come the uh, customer, the user, that will be able to buy the content from the marketplace and this content will be provided by the uh, developers. So this is a very interesting thing then because the developers now can monetize their uh, creative work because now they just can create it and nobody uses it. But uh, in Arcona they will be able to sell it with a token. They will get every time the royalty for the usage of this content. Uh, they will receive it immediately and the token will be used as the internal currency between these participants of the ecosystem. So this is the main usage of the token, but it's not the ones, not, not only one deficit is set in the ecosystem. So I can mention, I can talk about it a little bit later when we uh, talk about the land. Yes, my next question is actually about what is the digital land? What is it? Digital land is the main deficit asset in our ecosystem. We have two deficit assets as a token, as everyone has, and the digital land the second or maybe the first one, the digital land, is the first deficit asset in the ecosystem. So imagine that uh, you can change the, your surroundings, real surroundings on fly. So you can add uh, different 3D content, 3D models in the real world. You can create different projects in the real world using augmented reality. And now imagine what you do in the real world when you want to create a project, when you want to open the shop or any project you like in the real world. You need the land because you need to put this shop somewhere in the on the planet. So you need the land. The same happens in our world. So if you want to put any 3D content in the in augmented reality ecosystem, you need the land. So we are selling this information space, this land that is directly linked to the real world. I mean, you can buy the digital land in the center of New York put any 3D content on this land and it will appear directly on that place in the center of New York. And you can do it remotely by sitting at home using your computer and uh, create everything remotely. So this is the digital land. So you put any object, any content on the digital land and that appears in the real world location. How to earn money on that? The same like in the real world. What you do with the land in the real world, imagine that you have that you own the land in the center of New York. You can create your own project. You can go to the marketplace and create the task for the for the developers and say, hey guys, I want this project. I want an advertising campaign or I want a game. Create a game here. So the developers will create the game for you. You take this game and put it on this plant. And uh, this will be the closed content for the fee. So the people will pay to you to use this content to play in this game in the real world. Or you can make this game for free and then you will gain the money from the advertising. 
Imagine that you have the land in the center of New York, you create an interesting project there, the people are coming to that place to work and to interact with augmented reality, and then you can put the advertising around that place. So you can go to the big players, or the big players will come to you because they understand that this is a new channel of advertising. And uh, these big companies will come to you and put their advertising on your land, and you will gain money for that. If you are not an entrepreneur, you can do the following thing. You can rent this land, just owning me, being the landlord. You can rent it, or lease, lease it, let's say, to another entrepreneur who know how to build, uh, how to uh, build a project and how to gain money on it. So different, different business models uh, we can provide. So it can be online shop, it can be a game, it can be advertising, everything you want. So the yeah. gaining money is to just make the copy of the real world. So what you do having the land in this space, and you will have the answer because it's the real world. So nothing new. Am I understood right that Arcona is my perfect life when I can save and rebuild it if I want? Is that right? So uh, you can change the surroundings. It's, not, it's your real life, but you need to understand that all the content that you will put on the land around you the people will see it, all the people will see it simultaneously, for sure, if you want. So you can you can reboot, you can change the surroundings, so you can change the sky if you want. You can change the side scenes, the, the view from your window in the morning. Everything is limited by your imagination. Because if you think that the world is already created, I'm sorry, you need to think again. Because now we are creating the new world. And now, Let's think that the people have the imagination. We have the very creative people in the world, but they do not provide the content because they cannot monetize it. They, they are not protected because they can understand that they are not protected and this content will be used by other people and they will not gain the money for it. And now we give the tools and the space for these creative people to provide the content for us for the users, and we will use this content, use this creativity to change our world, to change our surroundings. It's all incredible. Let's talk about your marketing strategy. What is your roadmap and in which status we will see Arcona project in future? So let's start from the from our background, because uh, the, the project already is being developed uh, for uh, two years, but the company was founded four years ago in 2013. We started working with augmented reality. We started developing the projects. Let's say the augmented reality market was zero four years ago. Nobody knew about augmented reality. Only in 2016, the Pokemon Go showed the world what does augmented reality mean. And now imagine that we could find the niche and started generating the revenue from augmented reality. So we are a bookstop company. And until today, we have already eight different projects in six European countries that these projects are working and generating the revenue. So we sold that project. I am talking about the tourism market, as I mentioned, that we, are, we were developing the, we were reconstructing and rebuilding the missing architectural masterpieces in uh, tourism places. So these projects already work, and we found the niche how to how to generate the revenue in augmented reality. So the company is. Uh, we have everything to build our project. I mean, the potential we have. So uh, now it's just to create the community. So the roadmap, the next the next steps are to create the community of Arcona, because now we have already the technological part and we are still working on it, but we have already our own computer vision system that we develop by ourselves. So we don't use the third parties, we use our own platform. Uh, so now we are going to ICO to create the community of the enthusiasts of the AR uh, participants who will love to join us and to develop the project together. That's why we are creating the open source system. The next year we'll already launch the uh, marketplace. In the first quarter we'll be launching the marketplace. We will, the token will be in use already. After the ICO, during the March, when the ICO will be finished, only for the token holders, we will launch the auctions. During these auctions, we will sell the digital land. So we will start with the 10, the most popular uh, cities in the world, 
We will take the centers of these uh, cities like Tokyo, New York, Moscow, Barcelona, Beijing. Uh, even we will sell the plots of the land on the auctions to token holders. So it means that only token holders will get that opportunity to buy the most sweetest places in the world in March because because before we go listing because we go listing in April. So okay, in April everyone will be able to buy the token and uh, take the participation of the auctions. But first first month it will be just for the token holders. And then by the end of the year we will launch all these ten cities. We will launch the our AR viewer the application, and the system will start working. Sounds great. Tell us please about your team. Who is in your team? Who are these people? So the, the founders of the company, uh, they've worked together already more than 10 years. They had different businesses. In the past, they worked, uh, they had a journal, tourism journal. That's why this journal lead uh, in tourism. So that was the, the link, how it worked. Um, I joined the team uh, more than one year ago. So I bought the stake of this company. So I'm basically, uh, let's say, active business angel. So I fell in love with the project and I bought it and I bought a stake in this company, in the project. And now I am leading the company also. And the developers, we have the team of developers who are working with us already more than three years. Uh, they are still working on the project and they're developing the platform. So all the company believes in, all the company and all the team believes in magic. This is our main, main spirit. We believe in magic. Because not believing in magic, you cannot create anything. We believe. What do you think about another interview with us after your success or maybe before your ICO? One more thing about me, I am very open-minded. And I'm very open to the world. So I love the world, I love the people. So I'm every time open to communication. I would love to share all my experience that I have. So if someone would love to talk to me and uh, would love to hear from me any information from my previous experience, I can share it for sure. And uh, I ever think about the project. I can talk about the projects days and nights. So you can call me anytime and I'll be open to, to tell you everything about the project that you want. So. Welcome, always welcome. Because we need, we are here to share. I'm here to share in this world. Thank you for your time. It was an awesome interview. We also believe in magic and we wish you good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Join the project. Welcome. Welcome to the new world. Welcome to Arcona. It was Daniel Girdea, co-founder of the Arcona project with us in the Colesco News Studio. See you soon.